Erie County wants to get the upper hand on a species that's starting to sneak into our local forests, and they need your help. The invader is the hemlock woolly adelgid. The woolly what now? Yes, nothing like this, not by a long shot. You have to zoom in very close to see them. Closer, there we are. So these guys may be small, but they can do a number on the environment. The hemlock woolly adelgid is described as an invasive aphid, and not to get too technical on you, but they suck, sincerely. They suck sap from plants, specifically the eastern hemlock tree. Erie County forester Shane Daly explains why that is such a concern. It's a small insect um, that attacks the needles of the tree and eventually will kill the tree within four to ten years. The eastern hemlock is an important species of tree that is a critical part of our forest ecosystems here in western New York. They provide shelter uh, during the winter times for the deer um, and other animals. Um, they cool the creeks in the springtime, so our native brook trout and brown trout um, really depend on uh, cool streams to, to swim in and breed in. These woolly pests are not a huge problem now, but if we don't do something about the ones that are hanging around, they could bring friends, and that could become a huge problem. Erie County is working with the Western New York Partnership for Regional Invasive Species Management, and they could use your help. They're asking volunteers to go out into the woods and report back if they see any of these fuzzy intruders. This time of year, you have to have an especially sharp eye. Especially when the tree's fully infested, it kind of looks like snow on the tree. If you do see them, they'll ask you to download an app where you can report your findings. Now they've planned an organized hunt for Saturday, February 8th at 10.30 a.m. at Chestnut Ridge Park. If you want to take part, meet at the commissioner's cabin and be sure to wear warm clothes and sturdy shoes. Erie County is fortunate that we've only had small infestations that were able to be controlled, um, and uh, <clears throat> so we'd like to keep it that way. And that's how taking a little walk in the woods can make a very big difference.